So who am I? I'm blessing over your hood across it. Lil D, aka Mr. Freeze, aka Blame Mr. Pitt, aka the underwater angel. The ghosts in this blame it on me, I'll be frosted. Frost keep falling on the city. Still blame it on me, I'll be frosted. Frosted. I've been checking it from dust to dawn. The hustle starts slip from nervous to calm. What it do? This little deal, Block Kings Entertainment, coming at you with another video. The name of this video, The Three Elements of Getting Things Done. Yeah, you heard it correctly. The Three Elements of Getting Things Done. The successful become successful because of the daily choices that they make. The choices that they make on a regular basis. One thing that the successful do is practice principles that bring about the outcomes that they're looking for. There are basically three. There are basically three ways of thinking, three principles that you can set forth right now to get you where you're trying to go. These three principles can improve whatever goals you have set in mind. I know the strong stacks of revenue. You've been wanting, want to death from you. I know they wanted with the breath from you. I'm not the snitch, but I'm here for you to be the principle one. Greek men to play the fool to praise God, get you raised too. These motherfuckers got a motor too. You trust none and watch your life. That's right. Don't just live. Learn. All of us have heard the cliches. You only live once. Even though this is a cliche, it reigns supreme. This statement is more true than it is false. In the fast pace of life, it's easy to get caught up in the moment and the day just goes by so fast that you don't even recognize that it's moving. Now, as an artist, you live by experience. Take the time out and try to experience all that you can as it's moving. Pretty much try to learn something from it every day, if possible. Because it does move pretty fast. We are already six months in. We are already six months in a new year. Gone. Life is about lessons and it's about experience. Taking this into account can make you a better artist. And that should be what you're trying to do anyway. Being a better artist enhances your creativity. At the same time, you're learning what it is that creates a better life. That way you can enjoy the skin that you're in. That way you can enjoy the life that you're living, be it joy or be it pain. We all have triumphs and we all have tragedies. That's just part of life. But when you understand this, it creates a better artist. And that way you are a true artist instead of one that just breathes. Principle number two. And it's a must if you better root. Let the rocks cool, glass of the great goose. To block the pass or to get a boost. You showed your ass, did you find the truth? Know when to quit. I think that a lot of times you're not able to get where you're trying to go because you're not able to let go. You gotta let go so that you could grab something else. Quitting has been associated with failure. Quitting, in fact, is one of the things that should keep you moving. Quitting cuts off the things that are not elevating you. You're cutting it loose. Therefore, quitting cannot be associated with losing. It's just how you look at the thing. You have to kind of look at quitting as a strategy, a chess move. Quitting certain things that's taking up your time gives you more time to focus on the things that you're trying to get accomplished. Why just sit there and wait on the bus when you could get in your car and make it over there in 15 minutes? Quitting or pulling away from certain situations frees up your time. Time is very valuable. Ask any successful person. In this game of life, you have times that you prepare and you have times that you execute. Execution is very crucial. It takes time to prepare and it takes time to strike. So what I'm saying is uh, quitting things that aren't elevating you is a strategic move to put you in the right place where you can plan and you can execute because that's what successful people do. Learning the principle of learning when to quit, learning to open your eyes and using the principle of learning when to quit 
will actually pull you closer to the things you're trying to accomplish. The treatment bitches puts me out like you. So fuck the fans strictly after loot. It's only got the top to join the view. It's Betty Green, no Savin new. I'm spreading but it's like I got a few. I principle three. The pay for it principle. The pay for it principle. Start small, but I find a group. You don't like how I'm living then fuck you. This frost keeps falling to the city. city. Blame it on me, I've been frost. You've decided that you're an artist, you decided you're a producer, you want to start something grand, uh, an upstart to a business. When you first start out, you gassed up, you can't wait on that bus, you want to jump in your car and get there as soon as possible, and that's cool, I understand that. Don't get me wrong, you're supposed to be gassed up, you're supposed to get in your car, you're not supposed to wait on that bus. Just hear me out, just hear me out on this, just hear me out. <clears throat> Let me finish. Quit jumping ahead. At first, you're going to feel the need that you have to make every decision. You have the, the feeling that you're going to have to sign every document that comes across the table. For some reason, you think you have to cross every T and dot every I. This works in the beginning because, you know, you amped up, you gassed up, you want to get things done. I get it. You naturally have the energy to do so. There's a need when things weren't moving and then you see things moving forward to fruition that you would want to see every success so that you could claim it as your own. It feels good to know that you're living and not just breathing. But as your business grows, your mind could be moved towards making better opportunities. As your business grows, you're going to have to learn how to quit doing everything yourself. Your business becomes business. That's how jobs are created. And this is where the pay for it principle comes into play. You can look at any successful company, any successful business, and you can find a team. What I'm saying is learn how to use your new given revenue to invest in growing your business. You can't do everything yourself. The thing about revenue is it gives you the opportunity to free up more of your time to do what you want to do, be it grow your business or however, or more time for your creativity. That way, instead of just getting results, you get more results more frequently. Business should come in steps. When you first start out, yeah, it's okay to do everything yourself. But as time moves on, learn to invest in people and products that will get you further along. It's a tax right off anyway. You can't lose. I remember when I first started doing records, you know, I had a keyboard, I had some instruments, I had, you know, I was trying to make the beat, write it, record it, everything. You know, mix it down, put it on this, everything. Came a time when I figured out, hey, came a time when I figured out, hey, came a moment when a light bulb in my head went off like, bing, if I pay a producer to produce the beat for me, that's what he do, that's what he specialize in, he could make something better than I could create. And I have no problem with that. First and bottom line, I'm a writer. So I figure if I write, I'm doing what I do best. Hire me a producer, they create the beats. I don't have to worry about that. All I gotta do is focus on what I do best. I remember I used to come up with the beat, I used to record it, I used to mix it down, you know, and put it on CD. Got to the point where I was like, hey, I can send this off to people that can mix it, master it, engineer it, people that enjoy working in the studio, you know, all night, all day, trying to tweak it just right and, and get the drums here and get the drums there and, you know, pan this voice to the left and pan this voice to the right, you know, stuff like that. I figured out, you know what, why don't I let him do that and let me focus more on the writing. Freed up more time for me to write on the beats that I was purchasing. Freed up more time for me to write more because I knew my songs would get mixed down and mastered professionally. Business creates jobs. 
Life is governed by rules. Life has certain principles that when followed correctly produce results. Certain principles create certain results. And that goes if you believe it or not. Just because you don't believe in gravity don't mean you could walk off a cliff and it ain't gonna happen. Principles are put in place because principles produce certain situations and circumstances. This frost keeps falling to the city, city, blame it on me, I've been frosted. Frost is warm, put some running through the bags. No the direction where you need and change. The satisfaction when you get learning to adjust and learn from what you're living, knowing how, where, and when to quit, and learning the pay forward principle are three elements that you could apply right now to enhance your pursuit of happiness. This is Lil Deal Black Kings Entertainment. Thank you for watching my videos. Thank you for buying, purchasing music. You can find the links in the description box below and through this video. We also put some other videos in place, in motion, on this video. You can click on them. Check out my other videos on YouTube. We're at 999 Block Kings. It's my YouTube station. We're back in action. We're going to start cranking out these videos because I feel like it's something that needs to be said. It's something that needs to be given. And at the end of the day, y'all are just swell people. Thank you for your support. Thank you for keeping me on the other side of the glass. Get ready for the new album, Living Twice. This is Lil Deal Block Kings Entertainment. Peace. Hit the metal, put the combinations to the set The sound speaks in mysterious ways The clothes breathe that I've been led astray It's been a week since I got my pay To get this chat to show I misbehave I get rebellious in the streets, bed blood stains This understood, I put my guns away I'm just a gentleman to be afraid I'm boss water, so I play the game You want it all, and I suggest the same Put the blinds, wipe the frost, view the lights of the city Got my green backs in 20s and 50s Doing life like a wonder would hit me Embrace the night, I'm shaking dice, that's in work you bring Made it to the other side, shut the fuck up the king Find low pop designs are empty The action bowls, screeching ties, don't tempt me This cross keeps falling to the city, city Blame it on me, I've been frosty